Hi guys, Jules Mama Vapes here and today we're looking at this and this is the Armadillo RDA and this is in conjunction with Umier and a brilliant Belgium reviewer, Dimmy Crazy Damper. So what we'll do guys, go down low, have a look, have a quick unboxing, the usual blurb, a few pictures of the build, come back up top and I'll tell you my final thoughts and I'll see you soon. And here we are guys, down now looking at the Armadillo RDA jointly designed by Umier and Dimi Crazy Damper. And Dimi Crazy Damper is a Belgian reviewer. So let's have a look at this. Here's the box, it's the outer sleeve, nice and front, as you can see, nice frontage. I've got the silver one. I'll keep it on there just for a little bit so you can see that because obviously we're not allowed to use clickable links now, but that does say www umiervape.com if you ever need to have a look at them scratch and sniff all their socials on the bottom there it's got their usual information that you would expect so let's turn it round let's get it out and there's the box nice armadillo picture with armadillo written on RDA again it's the usual things what you would expect same as what was actually on the outer sleeve and there it is so let's open this up nice and easy to open up because of the cutouts which it makes a nice change because a lot of boxes are difficult to get into and there it is the armadillo so let's get that out i'll pop it on an atty stand that was from dilly gaff atty stands let's pop it on there so i can show it you all later let's see what's in the box so underneath the felt you do get your instruction or user manual again nicely presented good quality paper it's got all your information that you'd want it's in also different languages which makes it handy for anybody else so let's pop that to one side inside here you get the box let's get that out sorry about the shaking and there it is inside this box is your extras so that is your organic cotton and also your T screwdriver set it's got your o-rings it's got your squonk pin and it's also got two coils in there sorry it doesn't give you any information about what kind of coils it's using though so let's put that to one side and let's concentrate on the main attraction so that is this guys here it is the armadillo and as you can see i've got it on one of dilly gaff's atty stands that he gave me beautifully done this is so it is a 24 millimeter diameter it does have a 510 drip tip let's open that up so you can see the deck on this thing look at that for a deck for building on isn't that amazing really quite something different nice deep juice well so these you get three holes on each side of the post and that makes it so it's compatible for different size coils. So if you're using too small, a small coil, put it there. Larger coils. And obviously you do the same on the other side. Nice dual deck. If you're going to use a single coil in it, you're not going to get the best out of it. It is for dual coils, guys. Even though you could put a single in, it wouldn't get the best for it. So make sure you use a dual coil. So what can I tell you about it? It is a 510 thread. It is a double coil RDA. It does have a side airflow. So let's have a look. And there's these as well. See that how it sticks out, protrudes? It fits into there, that groove. So make sure you line it up, put it in so it locks it into place. And here's the airflow. So you can turn it just using this bit here. It's got some gnarling to help it easier to turn. It isn't locked in, so it does turn all the way around. And what you do on one side happens on the other. The good thing about this is you can close it off quite a lot, put a different drip tip on the top, and you can use it as a mouth to lung device. Obviously, I'm using it as straight to lung. So it is really, really nice, guys, this. Look at that for workmanship. It really is. So inside, again, it has got some lovely doming. This part inside does come out. I can't get it out yet because it's not oiled up because I've you no know, juiced up. But it does come out for easy cleaning, and that part is... The piece there that you can see for when you close it that does come out so that's it guys so what we'll do is we'll get a build in it we'll go back up top and i'll tell you what it's like to vape and i'll see you shortly
right guys so here we are back up top and i've got it on the black one at the moment as you can see got the black one on the go i've also got the rose gold one on one of my mechs which um, goes really nice actually really nice and there's the silver one now as you can see this protrudes really well so it is compatible for using with your mech devices if you wish to so let's have a quick vape shall we Now, I've got to admit, I've really enjoyed this. I really have. I do have some bad points, and I do have a lot of good points. But before we get into that, let's have a go on the mech. Wow. That is delicious absolutely delicious guys anyway so that's my juice that gives it away doesn't it you get really good flavor from this i actually thought although i thought you'd get some flavor from it i did think it would be more of a cloud chucker and i'm happy and pleasantly surprised it gives good flavor and it's great with clouds too so it does appeal to everybody people who love the flavor people who like to cl throw clouds the only bad point I've really got to say about it is, is on the black one, chain vaping. I'm a chain vapor, I am. And I've noticed that the black one gets really quite hot when you chain vape. You don't have that problem with the rose gold or the silver one. It's just the black one I found gets hot. But apart from that, I can't complain. I love the flavour. I think it looks really good. It looks great on a mod it any mod it just it looks nice it really does guys doesn't it i mean look at that i don't know if it's picking it up very well hopefully it is but that is it it is so nice the armadillo and i've really really enjoyed using it mm. yeah i've like i say good flavor guys it really has good cloud production as well very very easy to build on it, anybody could do it it really is that simple to build on i think dimmy's done a great job with the des designing of this because he's made it so it fits any coil really really is a good thing so i've got nothing more to say guys i mean i'm just really really enjoying it so i'd like to thank umia and dimmy because they sent it me for the purpose of review <laughs> review i did get all three um colors and i'm really really appreciate that thank you so much guys for sending that to me i'm really enjoying it it's become one of my favorites at the moment like i say i've got it on my single top side at the moment and i'm really really enjoying using it on that I think it looks nice on this so that's the one that is going to be used and this one is staying on this mech because the rose gold matches that part there and i just think that looks so so nice on the claymore really does look good so that one is living on there so it keeps me the silver one to use with all the things so that's it guys so remember mama knows best vape don't smoke i love you much say and i'll see you soon bye now